Hello and a very warm welcome to all our viewers. You're watching the morning news show with me, Sakshi Singh Litoria on CNN News 18. And for the next 30 minutes, we'll be bringing you all the latest news and developments from the nation and across the globe. Starting off with some news on Mahua Moitra. As amid the ongoing cash for query route, Trinamool Congress MP Mahua Moitra has launched a fresh and scathing attack at the centre. Moitra took to social media and said, as she is busy with Durga Puja, CBI is invited to come to her home and in fact count her pair of shoes. She also demanded NIC to release all details of MPs publicly to show that they were physically present when the, their login was actually used. Meanwhile, the cash for query controversy has snowballed as Shiv Sena Uddha Bala Sahib Thakre's MP Priyanka Chaturvedi has come out in support of Mahua Moitra. She said that Moitra has every right to defend herself. The Trinamool Congress, on the other hand, continues to distance itself from the controversy. BJP even lashed out at the Trinamool Congress for its silent approach. BJP has said that it is surprising to see that Mamata Banerjee has abandoned Mahua Moitra because Mamata will defend no one else but Abhishek Banerjee. We've seen the tweet, but how do you see the allegations that have been made against Mahua Moitra? They're very serious in nature. There's bribery on one side and there's the compromise of the credentials of the parliament login on the other. So uh, two things I'd just like to say. Allegations need to be proved in any court of law for any kind of conviction to happen. That's step one. So allegations, everyone can make some allegations against X, Y, Z. But it, the onus of proving those allegations are by those who have made those allegations. That's point one. Point two, I have read uh, both the both the affidavits that have been put, the notarized uh, statement by Ms. the by the industrialist. It categorically did, does not even once say that the parliamentary questions are being used for the bribe that is supposedly being given to uh, the member of parliament. All my my tweet is about this. A member of parliament is supposed to file five questions. That's the maximum. And if they file above that, it goes for another day. A ballot chooses if that question comes as a starred question. Otherwise, it goes as an unstarred question where you do not have any follow-up questions to mm. do. The information that usually comes out is information which more or less is in public domain. So, if someone wants to file an RTI or a PIL, mm. it, there are better chance of him getting that information. So, mm. let's say, and I'm only talking hypothetically, sure. if someone wanted to defame somebody or someone wanted to get information out of somebody, mm. They wouldn't, they wouldn't use the parliamentary questions for all I can say. Because of the disruptions, we don't even have the question hour. Hmm. So what are we even talking? Yeah. I'm not aware of this issue, but I have read some of it in parliament. I think it's with the ethics committee. So let's see what the outcome. I'm not aware of this issue, but I have read some of it in parliament. I think it's with the ethics committee. So let's see what the outcome. No comments on this particular issue. We have nothing to say on it. So no comments, please. No. Regarding particular this issue, All India Trinamool Congress will not say a single word. We have nothing to say and no comments on the particular issue. The related person, the related person may explain or answer the issues, but not Trinamool Congress. देखिए महुआ मोहित्रा का जो केस है वो इस देश की संवैधानिक व्यवस्था को छिन्न भिन्न करने वाला है और कई जगह ये राष्ट्रीय सुरक्षा से भी खिलवाड़ है निशिकांत दुबे जी का उठाया हुआ प्रश्न बहुत बड़ा है और मेरा विश्वास है कि अगर टीएमसी ने समय रहते इस पर निर्णय नहीं लिया तो टीएमसी के खिलाफ पश्चिम बंगाल की जनता निर्णय ले लेगी Now shifting focus to the entire debate around caste census, Tamil Nadu Chief Minister M.K. Stalin on Saturday urged Prime Minister Narendra Modi to integrate caste census with the upcoming National Decadal Census. In his letter, Stalin stated that the crucial caste-related data outcomes would touch the lives of crows of deserving people in the country and it should not be delayed anymore. The Chief Minister further said that the government in some states like Bihar made good attempts in conducting caste-based survey. The BJP State President 
President K. Anamalai, on the other hand, lashed out at the DMK and called the party as an quote unquote abode for double standards. Now, K. Anamalai also accused DMK of protecting corrupt ministers. He further said that DMK and its ally did nothing to release the socio economic caste census of 2011, and the people of Tamil Nadu will teach them a lesson.